This is AntiTube. You know, over the years, I have worked on a lot of uh, foot controllers, speed controllers, foot pedals. I mean, a lot. <laughs> um, probably most, mostly, I have done the the rather famous button style, um, like this one from a 221K. Uh, in early 301 uh, slantomatics I've, I've repaired them done full restorations I've replaced them which is where some of these came from because the person didn't like the that they got hot and they wanted more slow speed control so they had me put on uh, electronic and this is the style B. And like I said, I've done an awful lot of these. And I, I did a nice uh, little mini series about how to restore one of these. And then I've also done some of the style E that has the, uh, the little silver flag like this. And I've done quite a few style F, which is more commonly called a clamshell style. That became more popular later on. Now this is a very small number of styles that that Singer has. Uh, I do mostly these because of the vintage machines I do, but you know, they went to electronics too. They went to electronic foot controllers and they had an air controller and, and uh, so forth. But I'll tell you what, uh, my friend Shelly sent me a vintage Singer foot controller that I had never even heard about. Wait till you see this. Let me get it. If I remember right, she had bought this, I think maybe from eBay. And uh, it was just unique in her mind. So she bought it. When she got it, it needed a lot more work than she realized. And she thought, I might like playing with it. So she, so she sent it to me. And take a look at this. <laughs> now maybe some of you have seen this. Or maybe some of you have this. But I had, I had never seen it. I had never heard about it. <laughs> and I was like, wow, look at it. It's, it's like they took the sole of a little shoe <laughs> and put it right on this foot controller. <laughs> and man, it's pretty stiff and the, the cords are pretty ratty and beat up and chewed up. Uh, one of the connections here is broken like a rivet broke off. But let me take the, let me see... Oop, there went another little piece somewhere. <laughs> Let me take this top off and look what's inside. Now these are carbon stacks or carbon piles in here. I know they are. And I'm like, wow, this, this must be like the, the first foot controller <laughs> that they ever made. Look at these, look at these heavy duty springs in here. And, and how uh, the adjustment nut is and everything. And it's all all metal. Of course it has part numbers on it. And it did have at one time rubber feet. It just has these hard <laughs> hard things now and one's missing. But would you look at that? Wow. <laughs> so I, I, I started doing research on this and I'll tell you what I found on a website in the United Kingdom that um, I mean it's active but 
they used to sell parts and so forth, and I don't think they do that anymore. But I found a, a list of motors and motor controllers, and darn if they didn't have a little picture of this, and they called it a Type A. A, so A like the first in the beginning. <laughs> so maybe I'm right. This this maybe is the first foot controller that Singer ever made. <laughs> I don't know. And they and they said it was for the model. It was made for the model 201. And uh, here's the type of plug it has, and, and it's uh, got little brass knurled knobs in there you twist around the wires it's a shame that the cord is is so old now and and beat up and not usable but um, I looked around all over Google images and the internet and I, I found like my two two pictures maybe including this is the better picture from a blog I think where a lady's husband had had restored one of these for her. Let me show you that picture. It's all shiny. So, just not much about it. Now, I do know the 201 had a few versions. You know, most people, the 201, 201-2, or 201K. There were several versions of the 201, and it was made from 1934 to 1981. And I got the feeling that this was something maybe from the 30s or 40s. <laughs> but um, let's see what it says here. 95 to 145 volts, 0.6 amps, part number 132887, that famous red Singer S, Samanco USA. So, uh, that's what this little series is going to be about. I'm going to take this apart and see how it works. And I'll probably have to replace the cord. I don't know if I'll wire it for a 201 or for a, or not. I guess I'd like to, since that's what it was for. But um, paint it. I don't know if I want to paint this pedal. Look at that. That worn is just kind of cool looking. But the rest of it's pretty beat up too. It was all shiny like the inside before, so I, I guess maybe I'll paint it like that other guy. But anyway, that's what I'll be doing in this little series of the Singer Type A foot controller with many thanks to Shelly for her generosity. I hope you can watch some of the videos. Take care.